Hi there, welcome back to our series on A-B testing. Today we are touching on something that ties everything together, the EPIC framework. It's a straightforward guide aimed at optimizing your digital marketing experiments. EPIC stands for Experimentation, Priority, Impact and Cost. Four pillars that ensure your strategies are both effective and efficient. Let me show you how understanding EPIC can streamline your process and save you time and resources. Plus, there's a Google Sheet waiting for you at the end to help kickstart your next project. Before we dive deeper into the nuances of A-B testing, it's important to ground our research based on real actionable data. Speaking of which, if you're new to the concept of analyzing user behavior data to drive website optimizations, I highly recommend checking out my previous video on heat maps. In that deep dive, we explored the why behind heat maps, saw them in action, and went through various types like movement maps, click maps, and scroll maps. We even touched on the value of user recordings and surveys to get a holistic view of user engagement. But understanding your audience's behavior doesn't stop there. It's about diving into the quantitative data that tells a broader story. Analyzing qualitative data through heat maps and recordings is crucial, but pairing it with quantitative analysis completes the picture. This involves looking at the numbers, like noting the percentage of visitors scrolling past the hero section, or comparing the click-through rates of buttons located in the hero section, middle, or foot of the page. By combining these methods, you might discover insights like a contact us button that's getting overlooked due to its size or placement. This observation then leads us to ask critical questions for our A-B test. Would a larger or more prominently placed button capture more attention and drive conversions. Armed with both qualitative and quantitative insights, you will be in a much better position to ask the right questions and form hypotheses for your A-B test. Remember, every adjustment, no matter how small, is a step towards creating a more engaging and effective website. Crafting hypotheses using the EPIC framework. To develop hypotheses, I've created a framework called EPIC, and this is exactly the same framework we use in our agency. This methodology isn't just about making changes, it's about making the right changes in the right order for the right reasons. Using real examples, let's break down the EPIC framework and how you can apply it. EPIC framework stands for experimentation, priority, impact, and cost. First up, experimentation. This is all about balancing the risk with the potential reward of the tests we run. A higher score here means we are looking at a bold, potentially game-changing experiment, while a lower score represents safer, more conventional tests. Next, we have impact. This measures the potential effect our experiment could have on important metrics like user engagement or conversion rates. The higher the score, the bigger the expected impact. Then there's cost. Here, we consider the resources needed for our experiments, but there's a twist. We score this inversely. A high score means lower cost, making the experiment more appealing to prioritize. And finally, priority. This isn't just a score, but a qualitative assessment that emerges from our other three components. It helps us decide which optimizations to tackle first, ensuring we're always focusing our efforts while they can make the most significant difference. By using the EPIC framework, we're not just throwing spaghetti at the wall to see what sticks. We're making informed, data-driven decisions and that balance innovation with practicality. Whether you're tweaking a landing page or overhauling your entire website, Epic helps you prioritize your actions for maximum efficiency and impact. Let's look at some examples. For instance, consider introducing live chat support on key pages. It's an experiment with a decent balance of risk and reward, offering a significant potential impact on user satisfaction and conversion with a moderate cost. It scores high in our EPIC framework, making it top priority to test. Or take revamping the hero section with a video background. This idea is riskier due to technical challenges, but the potential for increasing engagement is substantial. It's a high priority experiment given its high impact despite the higher cost. These examples illustrate how the EPIC framework can structure your optimization strategy, ensuring you're not just shooting in the dark, but making informed strategic decisions. And the best part, you can get that started with this approach right away. To help you dive deeper, we put together a detailed table of these examples and more, available as a Google Sheet. It's a practical tool you you can use to prioritize your own experiment. Check the link in the description below to download and start planning your strategy with Epic 
framework today. Remember, the key to successful optimization is not just in the tests you run, but in the way how you choose and prioritize them. With the Epic framework, you're well on your way to making impactful data-driven decisions. And that wraps up your quick dive into the Epic framework. Remember, the goal isn't here just to test for the sake of testing. It's about making those tests work smarter for you, aligning your efforts with the outcomes you're aiming for effectively and efficiently. With experimentation, priority, impact, and cost as your guides, you now have a better way to equip and navigate the complexities of A-B testing. This framework is here to help you prioritize your actions, ensuring you're investing your resources where they can truly make a difference. And as promised, we're not leaving you to figure this out on your own. Check the description below for a link to a Google Sheet template. It's a straightforward tool designed to help you apply the Epic framework right away, simplifying your planning process and helping you to get started with confidence. Found this video helpful? Give it a thumbs up. Your like tells the YouTube algorithm that the content is valuable, helping others like yourself find it too. Don't forget to share and subscribe and join us on this journey to smarter, more effective digital marketing. Your engagement is what drives this series forward. Thank you.